Hi everybody, we're headed back over to the farm stand to return her containers. Um, and I was just looking around and enjoying the scenery. I won't be going this route for a while, so I was really soaking it all in. I wrote her a little note to thank her for growing and arranging such beautiful flowers. And they're still in really perfect shape. And um, I just wanted to wash and return her containers to her so she can keep the joy going. Um, so I packed everything up and headed there. I just get such peace going there. Um, I'm not sure why, what it is about it. Maybe it reminds me of the good old days because it's the honor system and it's just so quiet and I just, it makes me feel really refreshed. Um, on the way there, it's a beautiful drive. You know, sometimes it gets so wrapped up, you know, in other pl places other people live, you know, the beach or mountaintops. And sometimes I take for granted all the beauty that is surrounding me in my own backyard, if you will. So I was pretty excited to see what she had uh, created or out there in her farm stand uh, this morning. So I just rolled on up there um, with, I had $6 on me, that's all they could put, but I can always get something there for very little. So I was pretty excited. So you'll see in a minute what I was able to get. It's just so peaceful there. It really is. So she had put out a couple things. Now I didn't really know what these were and that's the other beauty of going here is um, I'm learning. I learned a lot of, um, from her. She must be a, a, a gardener for a long time. Uh, she has some things I've never heard of and never seen our local nurseries, even the ones that have um, native plants to the Connecticut region. So I just love the setup of this. She also has fairy wands um, that benefit a local warming shelter, which is so thoughtful. So what I ended up getting was one, it looks like a Russian sunflower for $2 and then another perennial called tansy for $3. And it, apparently it makes like chrysanthemum type yellow flowers and has a lot of medicinal purposes. I haven't found a spot for these guys yet, but I definitely will. And um, there's the tansy that you're looking at right there. And I had never heard of this in my life. So I feel like this is such a good experience for me. I love driving over there. And also I'm learning from somebody who has a lot more experience with uh, native plants, perennials than I certainly do. And I just wanna thank you for going on this farm stand uh, trip with me and I will talk to you soon. Please leave comments. I love reading them and re, um, responding to you and have a great day.